Hey guys, it's Enready. I have one pickup today, and it's a CED. I don't have a player. Um, I got this early in the week. I visited Dr. Uh, Disc, and I was talking to Chris, and he had picked up uh, a CED player and some discs from his um, brother-in-law. Um, he gave it to him because he felt, uh, since he was into collecting vinyl music, that he would like, you know, vinyl on vinyl movies, which is what CED is. It's an analog system unlike Laserdisc that plays off a laser. And he gave this to me because I was a big fan of Star Wars. Um, I'll probably not ever get a player, but this is just more like a decorative thing for me because I've always loved this artwork. Um, okay, uh, so let's get into it here. Um, this uh, CED um, format was uh, created by uh, RCA back in the late 60s, and they had always planned to, like, sell movies on this format but they had a major problem in that uh, the disc could only hold 30 minutes on each side and by the time they were able to release it which was 1981 VHS had already came out it was it had been out for four years and Laserdisc had been out for two and but they were stubborn and even though like you know VHS was doing really well they decided they were gonna release this anyways and uh, so I think their projection was to sell like um, 200,000 units, and I think they only did half of that. Because their big selling point was that it the, v, the, the, CD, the CED players were cheaper to produce than VHS players. So, But they were hoping to sell 200,000 units, and they only did half of that. But the sales for these discs were really, were really good. So they, so they stopped producing the machines back in two, uh, 1984. And then right after they stopped producing it, the the sales of the discs went down. So they ended up uh, ceasing production of this uh, format in 1986. This is the back of it, obviously. it's This is just totally awesome. I'm really happy to have this. Uh, my buddy will probably end up buying a player soon, and maybe one day I'll stick it in. Uh, let me talk about the, uh, the flaws with the system now. Um... Since it played like off like a record, um, if Link got on the disc, it would skip, and sometimes Grime would get in on the uh, the grooves of the disc, and it'll um, it would skip even more. The only way you can stop it is by uh, playing the disc through, and then it would remove the the Grime. Um, this is designed to the last for 500 plays. I have no idea what condition this disc is in because I can't I can't open it up. It, you have to put it in the machine and it'll the disc comes out then and then you can play it in the machine. I'm going to put a link to the RCA um, promo video so you can see what, how it's supposed to look and how it's supposed to work. Alright guys, uh, thanks for watching and until next time I'll talk to you later.